Hey everybody, it's Ju Chantel. Welcome back to my channel. And today I have Chick-fil-A and I have a little bit of Pepsi and a little bit of maple syrup. So um, I have just their plain biscuit and I put jelly in it. And then I have the hash browns, which I put the hash browns inside the biscuit. So let me show you a closer look. So <clears throat> I already put the jelly on, but I like to put that hash brown, I call it my hash brown salad. I like a little maple syrup on my hash browns. So anyways, um, I was going to talk to you about, um, I just finished season, season two of Good Girls on Netflix. If you've not watched that show, you have to watch it. It's really good. Season two came out like December 31st and I was done with it within a few days. I'm ready for season three. I'm not going to give out any um, details of the show, but I like the show because not some shows, they, um, there's a problem and they solve the problem and then it's like over and done. I like the show because they see having problems over and over and over again. I mean, most shows do, but if you watch it, you know what I mean. Like when they think they're out of something, they did they just dig themselves deeper in the hole, basically. So, it's really good. And then, there's this new show that came on called cheer and it's just about this um junior college cheer squad in texas and they're the best of the best and they get kids coming from all around or not kids but young adults coming from all around to cheer at their school um <clears throat> A lot of them have really sad backstories, so it's really interesting because um, the coach is like everyone's mom, and she would try to help them as much as she can, you know? And some of them said if they didn't, if they weren't in cheer, if they weren't there, they'd probably be doing bad things, you know? But... It was only six episodes, so I literally watched all all of the episodes in one day except the last episode. I didn't have time to finish it, so I'm gonna wait till I um, get off work to finish it. But that's really good. I've never heard of the town before. Um, I, I looked it up. The population is like 20 something thousand, but I think it's called, what was it? Corsicana, Corsicana, Texas. So because the junior college, they're constantly getting new people rotating it out every couple of years. So it makes it harder, but they're still on top.
I know it doesn't sound interesting, but you have to watch it just because it may sound boring, but it's not. Because some of these, um, some of the stories they have, kind of crazy. Some, not all, but. A lot of people still think cheating is not a sport, but it's super dangerous. You can get a scholarship to go to college. Like, you know what I mean? There's good things about it, too. So. If that's how someone can get an education, I think they should do it. Anyways, hope that wasn't too boring, but if you have net Netflix, please check out Good Girls, um, season one and two, and um, the show is called Cheer. Check it out, because I think you'll just enjoy the backstories, even if you're not into cheer, but just listening to these kids' stories, and um, just them being a team, no matter what background they came from, and how they pull it together. I mean, obviously they have their ups and downs, like everyone. Um, but, um, I think it's a really, really, um, positive, um, program to be in. And then, you know, they have these little tiny girls looking up to these girls and it's just really sweet. So you should watch it. So like I said, good girl season one and two and cheer. Um, that's pretty much it. I'm out of food. I probably should order more cause I'm always hungry after, um, next time I'll order more, but Anyways, um, I will talk to you guys later. Please comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. And until then, I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye.